Oh, that's a double. Double. Double pump on those guys. Double pumps. What is up, fishing fam? Welcome back to another episode, y'all. Uh, thank you guys so much for tuning in to another one. Today, I'm on the beach right now. And you gonna know you guys know what time it is. It is the end of March and it is Pompano season. So on this week's episode, I am looking to target some more pompanos. But I will be showing you guys how to catch more fish and how to get on more fish doing one thing, one thing only is casting and looking for this spot that holds a lot of fish on the beach. So um, if you guys are new to the channel and enjoy this content, hit the subscribe button, guys. It's completely free. And if you guys enjoy the content, hit that thumbs up for me. Really would appreciate it. So we're gonna jump right into the episode, guys. Show you what we're doing. Show you what I'm doing in the last few weeks and how I've been getting on more fish. And let's go, let's jump into it. Hope you guys enjoy it. Let's get at it. All right, let's get started. What I'm using today is uh, Frisky Fins Pompano Rigs. Um, four hour egg sinkers, 50 pound floral, and a Frisky Fins Rod and that would be G. I'll be leaving the link down below to all the stuff that I'm using right now in all my videos recently, guys. So, um, what I'm doing and what I like to try out is uh, I try all three colors, green, orange, and pink. Now, whichever color gets hit twice, that's when I switch up all the raw colors as far as the uh, pompano rigs. Just because sometimes the colors do make a difference. And uh, last week it did the same thing. I had the green and I caught up about two in the green. So I'm gonna try the green now. If that works, then I'll go ahead and switch another rod with the green. There he is, setting it, setting it up right there. Fish bites in the back, sand flea in the front. And uh, what you guys wanna look for right here, and you definitely, if you want to catch more fish, definitely cast right here right there where there's waves forming and right here as you can see in between here it is completely flat that is exactly where you guys want to cast right there especially with the current pushing a lot of fish will come off this area right here and like pompanos and redfish and black germs other fish they'll come off the corner and open up to the area which is it's called the rip current so i'm gonna cast out here like i've been doing the last few weeks and see if i can get on some fish but if you guys are coming out here try this out very easy to tell you can see the wave formation and then you're gonna see it start opening up that is called a rip current which is an opening a deep area where a lot of fish are caught in areas like this all right let's go and cast out i'll be casting out a few rods about 50 yards 60 yards and one maybe possibly 100 yards which i'm gonna walk out see where they're at once i find them that's where they're gonna keep casting out guys all right y'all we are we are i think on a pompano yep might be a pompano we'll see right now we'll see it right now i think it's a pomp hopefully we just casting out right now we're just setting up the rods i got one rod out there with the orange and this one with the frisky fins uh pompano rigs with a green hopefully that's a pomp coming in oh he's fighting at the end guys there he is hopefully this is a pompy it's feeling pompy guys it's feeling pompy let it be a pomp we need a pomp to start the morning to start the afternoon i apologize there he is there he is let's see if we bring him in there we are guys There he is. Hit the green um, frisky fins and uh, green fish bites. There you are. First one up. Might be a little bit too small. Let's see right now. And uh, 
look is looks like it's about 11 inches we're gonna go ahead and release them there he goes there he goes i think we're on let's see he hit the rod i was putting my head down and this fish hit the rod oh my gosh let's see if we get him in oh my gosh there we go sub came out which means these fish oh he's shaking his head hopefully we don't lose him let's not lose him we need another one let's see if we bring him in let's see if we bring him in come on now oh man he is far out there we are there we are guys Pompano again on the green fish bites oh my gosh what a slab look at that slab Woo. there we are look at that right there ate the sample and and of course just to show you right there Take the sample, hit the fish bites, and his pompano is starting to hit right now. That is number two of the book. Oh, another one, guys. Another one's going off. Another one's going off, guys. Another one's going off. We got pompano's coming in. Oh, wow. Just put the rod down, another one hit. If you guys want to catch fish, that's why I tell you, look for these ripples. They tend to hold fish. Oh, he's coming in. He is coming in. He is coming in. We don't want to lose him. We're going to bring him in. We're going to walk him back. There he comes. There he comes. I see him. That is pompano number three of the day. Look at that slab. Woo. Guys, that is a slab right there. Wow. Jesus. There we are, guys. Two pompano's back to back. We're going to put the rod down. There we are. This one hit just the fish bites. Frisky fins, pompano rig, and uh, sinker guy sinkers. Same thing with this one. This one had some samples, guys. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, and put them in the cooler. See if we get some more. Like I said, look for these cuts, and you guys will find fish. This is a testament right here. Right here, opening holds a lot of fish. Now that the sun came out, I can even show you guys even better. We got already three pompanos, but let me go over it one more time with anyone that's coming out here. As you see right here, the wave formation, it starts to open up. And right here, as you see, it gets a little bit darker. That means there's a drop off. That means there's an opening. That means there's a, a nicer, darker spot where I'm catching all these pompanos right now. Even on a day like this, that it's not the best for me not the best condition for these pompanos because we're not yet in that uh temperature right now it's about 68 degrees where you really get these pompanos and other fish are 68 to 76 but my best days have come in around 74 to 72 degrees so it just goes to show you that even on these temperatures and the conditions you could definitely catch fish so we're gonna cast out some more um frisky fins some more fish bites and some samples and see if we get a few more we got two keeper pompanos and one short so let's keep it going see if we get lucky titan 
this sinker guy sinkers, and there we are. This one I'm gonna cast out a little bit farther than the other ones, about maybe 80, 90 yards, way out there. There it goes. There it is. Let's see if we get lucky and get some more. We got another one. We got one, guys. Oh, there he is. That's another one. That is another one right there. Hopefully, he doesn't come off. That's a nice pump on the right there. Come on. Come on. That is number. That's the fifth hit right here. Just like I told you. But hopefully we don't lose this one. We lost one right now. Come on now. Come on now, buddy. Don't come in. That one. I see him. It's a good size pump, guys. It's a good size pump. Let's see if we bring him in. Let's see if we don't lose them. Come on now. The rod got hit instantly. Oh, that's the double. Double. Double pump on those guys. Double pumps. Double pumps. Oh my gosh. There we are. There we are. Double pumps. They are running big right now. That is double right there. Double. Wow. Wow, there we are. Hit the fish bite, the fish bite. And this one hit actually the pink and white frisky fins. That's a These look about 14. Pretty good size right there. That's what we're talking about, guys. We got another one. We got another one. I think that's number five right there. Yep. Oh, he's fighting. He is fighting. Let's see. Let's see if we bring him in. That's a rod bender right there. Wow. Wow, he is fighting. That's not a small fish right there. Woo -hoo -hoo. He's fighting to the side. He's going to the side. There we are. Oh, that's a nice pump on the right there. Oh, let's see if we bring him in. Come on now. Oh, he doesn't want to come in. He doesn't want to come in. Ooh, hoo -hoo. Let's see. Let's see if we bring him in. Come on now. Come on now. There he is. There he is. He's shaking. He's shaking his head. Oh, there he is. That is another one. That's another slab right there. One more for the pop on the limit, guys. One more. That is another one. The bites the dust. There it is. Sun came out and they started biting. All right. Well, I hope all of y'all enjoyed this week's episode. And like I said, look for these few things out here in the beach and you'll definitely get on some fish. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And like I tell you, each and every episode, get out there, go fishing safely, get on some big fish for me, and we'll see you till next week, all right?